All of you. Unity received more than 200 nominations after delegates wrote it down on ballot papers in place of abstentions or candidates' names and surnames. Mpumalanga nominated ANC's Member of Parliament, Dr. Nkosa Zanajamini Zuma, to be the next leader of the party. Last week, ANC Secretary General Gwede Mantashe poured cold water on this unknown entity called Unity. There will be no vote for Unity because there will be no Unity on the ballot box. Okay. So there can be no vote for unity because there is no body called unity and therefore there will be no unity on the ballot box. Presidential hopeful Matthews Posa is taking none of this so-called unity. Animal called unity. For unity is Didi Mabuza. It's some, some scheme by a village boy trying to cheat the system. You know? If you check further information which is in our position, which we are filing at court. He says unity is me. He doesn't hide it. So which means he's got double votes on one ballot. It's the worst fraud in the electoral process of the ANC. There are people who are delegates who have been removed and replaced by people who are not delegates, who are never at BGMs. And we also have got information which we put before court indicating that. Now that's interfering with the democratic process in the great movement called African National Congress. To make sure that branches that are innocent go to the conference. Which uh, the court application stands. And on any of the legs, we can throw the whole PGC out. But we want to be very responsible as members of the ANC. And in a particular way, make sure that the branches which are innocent go to the conference. And that the branches which are tainted don't go to the conference. But it is not fair for all other provinces who are some of them bringing the legitimate delegates that we in Pumalanga must bring ghost delegates. But if there are provinces which are bringing ghost delegates, me, Matthew Porter, and I know about it, I would like to expose it. And I think it's our responsibility as members of the NC not to tolerate corruption because it corrodes the soul of our movement. The presidential hopeful is expected to file the court application this week. Lehana Tsutetsi, SABC News, Johannesburg.